What's up guys? I've got another very cool vlog for you guys today. Um, and today we're doing something very exciting and a little bit different. Um, but this is sort of going to open the door for a lot of things that I want to start doing as far as this vlog goes. Um, today we are opening up, doing my first ever unboxing of the brand spanking new iPad Pro. <laughs> Um, as I'm opening this, um, I want to tell you guys a story of how I even got this iPad Pro because um, I'm not made of money. Apple doesn't give me these things for free. I have to pay for them out of my own pocket. Convincing my wife to let me purchase one was an odyssey. Um, sorry, Christy, but I got to tell the truth. Um, but I want to tell you guys of how... Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Okay, let's give it up. Um, convincing my wife to let me buy one of these was not easy. So, um, first I got, I like, I like how it's hard to open. Um, I'll tell you what, let's press, put a pause button on this. I've also got the new, um, iPad pencil. Um, and again, I didn't, I, I technically, I didn't pay full price for any of these things. I'm gonna tell you what I did. So, um, you gotta respect the, the packaging, you know what I mean? You gotta respect it. Um, so what I did was I bought the previous um, 10.5 version of the, um, I bought the previous 10.5 version of the, of the, uh, ooh, ooh, look at that. Um, the previous 10.5 iPad Pro version. And so I happened to on a Wednesday, and I believe God works in mysterious ways. And this was God. Um, I dropped my phone and I broke it. It, it shattered and, and I just got the new iPhone XS Max or 10s Max I don't know, people hate it when yeah, anyway um, I got the new uh, phone and on a Wednesday I was moving a TV around the church and I dropped it on its base on, on the base of the TV on the wheels and it shattered so um, I went to Apple and I went to Apple um, check this out I went to Apple it's got that flat side here so I went to Apple and, and, and I was sitting there and it takes them a while. It does feel different. It's more like of a matte finish. It's super cool. Look at this. Look at this. It's super, super nice. Anyways, so um, I'm, I'm, I'm sitting there um, for like, cause it takes them like an hour and I had no phone, nowhere to go. So I'm just sitting at the Apple store, just hanging out. And so, um, I asked somebody, keep in mind, I had I had my old iPad for more than 30 days. And technically the return policy for Apple is to, um, that you only get 14 days to decide whether you want to keep the product or not. So um, I still wanted to ask a manager, see if there was anything that could be done. That's hard, that's hard open. I wanted to ask a manager, see if there was anything that could be done about trading in my 10.5, paying the difference and getting the 12.9 of the previous iPad Pro version. Um, and so as I'm there, um, as, I'm, as I'm there, um, this is super nice. Um, and as I'm there, I talk to a manager and I'm like, hey, you know, I, I'm a graphic designer. I do all these things and I, and I feel like the 10.5 was a bad call. I should have gone with the 12.9. And he's like, okay, um, you know, we'll make an exception. We'll trade it in for you. And so I traded my old iPad in and, uh, and then they gave me a new 12.9 of the previous iPad pro version. And then he comes up to me and he says, look, I'm not supposed to tell you this. Um, and they, they didn't even know exactly what was going to get, um, revealed at the, at the following, uh, Apple announcement, but he goes, there's a really high possibility that there's a new iPad coming out. And technically with the swap of the iPads, um, you're starting a new purchase. So he told me you have 14 days from that day to decide whether you want to keep the iPad or not. So what he was telling me to do was pretty much hang on to this new iPad that I'm giving you, the new purchase, um, and then uh, come back. If they release a new iPad, trade your old iPad in that you just got and just pay the difference. So technically speaking, I went into the Apple store and um, paid like a hundred dollars difference and I got the new iPad Pro. I mean, I was iPad list for like a week, but it was worth it. It was worth it. So 
long story short, I just traded iPads and it worked out all because it, I broke my phone. Literally, that's how everything happened. So um, I've got the new iPad Pro. And so let's let's open it up. Um, ooh, ooh, look at this, look at this. Look how, look at that. All right, so there's something about Apple and the way they package their stuff. Look at this. I mean, that is just insane. Like just the way they do things. All right, so this is the brand new iPad Pro. See, four speakers, four speakers. Um, no home button, so the bezels are very, very, very thin. And then uh, USB-C at the bottom, which is gonna help a lot because I'll tell you this, um, I, I, as I was podcasting on the road sometimes, um, there wasn't enough juice coming out of the USB port or the lightning port to be able to say um, power my my here. Let me see if I can bring it in my uh, my Yeti mic because it does take some juice to, to power it up. So now I can take my Yeti mic and I just plug it in, get one of those adapters for USB, and boom, you're you're I mean you're working because essentially you can power your iPhone and you can power um, whatever you know you want to power with it. So I'm gonna set the iPad aside for a second. Um, documentation, nobody ever reads that. Yada yada. Uh, new. Uh, New, new block and obviously like we said there's it's a USB-C um, let me see if I can get it out it's a brand new USB-C adapter and not uh, the usual lightning port uh, connector but um, that's all good stuff let's get back to the iPad um, I'm gonna turn it on right now I know, I'm excited. You guys don't understand though, like I've had the first iPhone since the day it came out and I've never had another phone. And like my hands have never touched like say a a Nokia phone or a, um, uh, I wouldn't even know what to do if somebody gave me an Android phone. Like operating systems, I, I just don't know. I just don't know enough about them uh, to be honest with you. So then we've got the new um, iPad Pro, it's all set. It's ready to go. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. So um, we're going to do a quick time lapse while I get it set up. Okay, so now I've got it all um, restored uh, from, from the backup that I had in the cloud. Um, I just want to show you guys like really how how amazingly thin this machine is. I mean, and it feels like good and sturdy and solid. Um, uh, another thing I want to show you guys is the speakers on this thing are supposed to be amazing. So let's let's play something. Let's see what that sounds like. If I can get to work. Let's see. I don't know if you guys can hear that. So it's got four speakers now. That's just insane. So it's got four speakers now. So you know. There's nothing on the private inside. So um, you may be asking me, that, so why are you showing us all this stuff? Like, why are you, you know, what's the point of it? This is the reason why I wanted to show you guys the unboxing of this is because I want to start creating. And actually, this whole vlog that you guys are, are watching was edited and, and done in this brand new iPad and how um, we no longer need, you know, a lot of the times I, this, I hear this a lot is I need a computer. I need all this, this, this and all these things um, before I can actually create a nice graphic for my youth group or before I can create a logo, before I can create all these things. So what I actually want to start doing is I want to actually create tutorials and how to use app based software so that you can create amazing graphics, so that you can create amazing video content and all these other things, um, so that you can use them for your youth groups, for your conferences, for your events, whatever it is. So what I'm going to do is anybody watching this vlog, um, any youth groups, anybody out there, I'm actually going to be doing three free designs to anybody that wants them. And we're actually going to be including that design with inside a tutorial on how to create graphics. So. Um, if that wasn't clear enough, what I'm going to be doing is three free designs, contact me, give me your event information. I will create a poster flyer, whatever it is that you want. And we will use that content 
for actually one of our future vlogs and how to create amazing graphics inside of an iPad or an iPhone and all that good stuff. So thank you guys so much for checking out uh, this vlog. There's a lot more vlogs happening. There's a lot of new podcasts that are going to be released. So stay tuned, nesmedia.com. Follow us on Facebook, on Instagram, all that good stuff. Follow us on, on all our social media. Just all you gotta do, all you gotta do is search uh, Nes Media and you're going to be able to find us. Thank you guys and God bless.